Well, Mayor Johnson, it's so good to meet with you. Uh, thanks so much for taking the time to talk with us today. Um, I guess my first question is kind of what's on the pulse for the town of Hope? What are you guys kind of working on? Well, at the moment we have three new subdivisions that we're working on. We have a new Best Western Hotel Motel Convention Center uh -huh. that is going to break ground hopefully any day. Uh, we have a possible, uh, we have a proposal I should say for um, a ski hill which is about 10 kilometers oh. outside of Hope. That's going through. That's that's really exciting. We're certainly hopeful that it will. Yeah, wow. A lot of hard work going into it, so we're very excited about that possibility. Um, we have our new recreation park upgrade that we're going to be doing this year. And on top of that, let me think, uh, oh, we've closed our landfill. Oh, and right. that will save the taxpayers of Hope about $8 million over the next 10 years. So wow. we're very uh, excited about that. Uh, so now backtracking a bit to the new recreation park, uh, what's kind of the vision behind that? Well, we preach healthy communities all of the time in our municipalities. And so this is just a way of drawing folks in to maybe have some recreation in our town, healthier lifestyles, biking. Um, we have a skateboard park that's been there for a good number of years. But this is a, an add-on, a dress it up a little bit. We eventually hope to have an off-leash dog park. We, we eventually hope to have like, new trails for folks to walk. And it should, be, uh, it should be a real hit. How do you hope to see it kind of impact the community? Well, more people, the restaurants are full, the streets are full, everybody has a spring in their step. We're looking to really, you know, high up our profile. Moving on to the waste transfer station. What were the challenges you guys faced kind of converting it into one? Well, at one time, as this was going on, we had our own garbage going there. We had them bringing in garbage in order to, to fill it. We had the most garbage in all of British Columbia. Over in, Cash Creek? Over Cash Creek. Really? We, <laughs> who wants to be known as the garbage <laughs> capital of the world, but right. we did in all of BC. So how do you feel now that it's all kind of completed? Oh, it's a huge relief. <laughs> It's been, it's, it's really been a lot of, a lot of work and uh, it's taken a lot of our staff time and... So, um, what is it about hope that you love? What's not to love? Look around you. I mean, hope has, has it all. We have the scenery, we have beautiful weather most of the time. Well, today's a good day. Today's yeah, a good yeah. day. We have wonderful little shops. We have great people. The folks in town are, take care of each other. We're too big to be small, too small to be big. It's like hair, it grows on you. Now I read uh, that you moved to Hope uh, quite a number of years ago. When you first came here, what, what was that thing that kind of struck you about it? Well, the truth is my husband was an RCMP officer okay. and we were posted here right. and that was 28 years ago. And we thought we would live in Hope for three years max. And like I said, it grows on you. And we just fell in love with the town and the people and the surroundings and we said we want to move and so they kept putting off a move until George retired. Now it's all good because we don't have to move anymore. That's great. Uh, looking on to sort of the near future, um, what are some things that you're excited about that are going to be happening in town? This spring we have July 1st is going to be of course a big uh, Canada Day event but uh, we're looking very much forward to our brigade days which happens in September and we have some big headline uh, entertainer coming into town and I think it'll draw a lot of folks that haven't been here before simply because it's a big name <laughs> and I'm not willing to share it right yet. <laughs> Are you sure? Come on! <laughs> well thanks so much for taking the time to chat with us today. Now one thing I do with mayors when they're uh, when we're doing this mayor episode of Go is I kind of give them the opportunity to try their hand at hosting. You, you up for that? Sure, nothing ventured, nothing gained. <laughs> Let's do 